Hey, what's up all you Valley Maniacs? Valley Flying here. I am back and like you, I am waiting for this update to drop. I am hoping that we get some good news. Uh, the date, 8-1 today, 11 a.m. Pacific. So exactly the time that the data mine uh, revealed last week. So uh, some good stuff there. And, you know, I must be living in a bizarre world because these devs, they are communicating on reddit they are actually interacting with the community dogs and cats living together mass hysteria i think this is awesome this is what we've been waiting for and i hope uh this update brings some good news because uh there's been a lot of bad changes in my opinion to the game some confusing some baffling ones and i'm hoping uh, a lot of this uh what happens with this update makes us say okay it makes sense uh, that's at least what I'm hoping for. So in this video, uh, I'm going to be talking about this update. I'm going to be talking about some of the comments that the devs made on Reddit because that is a lot of it is uh, relevant to this update. Before I get into that, though, I am playing on BlueStacks. If you want to play yourself, click on the link below. The channel gets credit. You get to play. It doesn't cost you anything. It's a big win. For everybody. All right, so let's go look at these comments. Uh, so there was a big uh, uproar because of the monthly login rewards. They got reduced, especially the big things like shards and power cores. Uh, there was a response to that. Changes to the 30-day login character are because we will be introducing a 7-day login character in the next update. I think they mean the update today. That will live up alongside so running concurrently to the 30-day calendar we wanted to launch them simultaneously but we're unable to do this this month the seven-day calendar calendar will have its own set of rewards so i'm hoping i am hoping that they replace some of the rewards rewards that they took out uh and this got better and we actually had a confirmation yes our plan is to roll it out tomorrow which means today we will know in a couple hours uh if uh what these rewards are and i am crossing my fingers that these are better i've uh, this is the only game that i've seen the daily rewards get worse so hopefully with these weekly rewards uh we will be getting them back to normal or uh, better they, they should be better i've never seen the login rewards in a game go backwards except for uh what i saw today all right so this is an interesting post the original uh question was asking about going out of a strike team if you haven't attacked yet you could look and see what's going on in the raid before you actually join and we have an answer for this as well this is something we've been working on in the next update I'm not sure if they mean 1.5 which is the next one or the one coming out today 1.4 uh but in the next update you will be able to preview the strike team raid map before launching so instead of joining right away you will now hit the preview and get an overview of the raid map who is currently playing on it and join and hit it from there uh sounds good uh, any more responses from them i don't think this is but uh, i think this is a huge change also from the data mine it looks like they are reducing the uh lanes of the level 50 raid down to seven so you don't need to have that 100 percent uh, doing everything super accurate anymore uh, that is the news, but there is a really big one that came. We got announced that Scarlet Witch is coming on Twitter yesterday, and we got some information about Scarlet Witch from the devs on Reddit. Thumbs up, guys. Uh, good news, bad news, communicate. That, that's, I think that's what a lot of us want, you know, even, even if it's uh, something bad. I, I do like that there is an open line of communication that seems to be building, uh, which is a good sky. All right, so... Uh, information about Scarlet Witch. Scarlet Witch will have her own event campaign. So reminding me a little bit of Ant-Man and Wasp. And she will unlock at two stars. So 45 shards to unlock her. We have more information about her event campaign soon. That sentence makes me uh, think that it is not coming tomorrow. I think she's coming to the game tomorrow. But uh, the actual event, I am uh, not thinking it's coming tomorrow by the way that sentence is worded. She has a really unique kit too. We're excited about that. Look forward to see the team comps that y'all come up with. Uh, someone asked if she has some synergy with Vision, and this is kind of the big one. Uh, she has synergy with her ultimate, so with his ultimate Solar Beam. When they're on the same team, she will apply bleed to each target. So if you guys aren't familiar with Solar Beam, 
That is the ultimate that removes buffs from everybody on the team. So not only are you removing buffs, you're also applying bleed to it when Scarlet Witch is on the team. Uh, strong skill. Uh, so my question for you guys, do you think that Scarlet Witch will change the meta? Uh, at least for Arena, I know Vision is on there already, so if you add Scarlet Witch, based on not seeing her kit, I, um, I guess I'm hoping she will. And some of that is because of what I heard on Casino's video where uh, he's talking about what the dev was using on his test account. Mordo, Thanos, Scarlet Witch, Vision, Doctor Strange. They said they were just wrecking everybody with that team. Uh, let's see what her kit is. But uh, my prediction is that she will change the meta. I, I, I guess I'm hoping for that. Let me know what you guys think about her in the comments down below do you think she will uh change the meta and her tags these are her tags they're somewhere down here all right uh from the dev team her tags are hero global mystic controller and avenger so good news good news guys all right so let's go back to this in-game email and uh we'll look at the official uh update Info. All right, four new playable characters. I think uh, at this point that is pretty obvious. Scarlet Witch, Nick Fury, Kamala Khan, and Loki. Uh, new legendary event, and that looks like that is for Nick Fury. A flash event. Now, there was a data mine that there was an event for Miss Marvel and Scarlet Witch. This could be the flash event similar to the Ant-Man and Wasp event where you need both of them at a certain star level, and you get better rewards as you unlock them uh my guess is that this is a new flash event that we're getting i know there's uh, info about the hand event uh the merc event these were other flash events but we've had them before so a uh, new one my guess my prediction and it's based on a data mine that uh, scarlet witch and kamala khan will have a flash event and event campaigns uh scarlet witch obviously is gonna have one from that dev statement and I'm thinking the other one will be Kamala Khan. So the way these four new characters are unlocked, Scarlet Witch and Kamala Khan will be event campaigns similar to the Ant-Man and Wasp. The Flash event is the Kamala Khan and Scarlet Witch Flash event. And my prediction for the Legendary event, not going too much out on a limb here. I think everybody knows it's going to be the Nick Fury event. Various raid improvements. Yeah, You just saw one with that dev... Uh, comment where you could go into the raids check out what's happening and not really join it uh i think that is good news we've also seen the data mine about reducing the lanes of the thanos rain I, the raid i think that is good news as well we will see what happens i hope there are true improvements though because we've been teased a lot of good stuff coming a lot of improvements and uh we've been let down so i hope they get a win on this as well new login calendar we've seen that and uh, we've seen the response that there will be a weekly calendar as well not just a monthly one so i am hoping that uh we get some good stuff i hope there's a bunch of wins with this update i hope there's a bunch of good stuff because uh these these last four six weeks have been very baffling with the some of the choices they've made in the game and i am hoping they will all make sense in this update and everybody will be happy we'll have a great game again and uh, we won't be left confused uh what do you think is going to happen though so let me know in the comments down below and that as well uh is there anything i forgot to mention uh is there anything in a data mind or any uh post that i did not mention let me know and we will see we will see in a few hours what happens so i will probably see you guys after this update drops doing a first impression just uh some of the new features hopefully they are all good hopefully it is a uh, positive video and if you like this video subscribe smash that like button and i will see you guys next time valley flying out